Hi friends, today we are going to develop a use case diagram for hospital management system with the help of rational rules. Okay, this is the use case diagram we are going to develop today. Uh, in this one we are having three actors. One is receptionist, second one is record system or admin, uh, third one is doctor. Receptionist and this is the system, it is having different use cases, scheduled patient appointment, scheduled patient hospital, admission, patient registration, patient hospital admission file insurance file medical reports and the record system or administrator what it can do it can perform add doctor by staff delete the doctor or staff edit the doctor staff info and the doctor will prescribe the test we can add the use cases for the doctor also as per our requirement okay so now we will start for use case diagram go to the IBM rational rules cancel we are going to develop the use case diagram right click on the use case view go to new go to use case diagram right here HMS hospital management system double click on this one the file we have created model okay now we have maximized this one if you will see we are having use case diagram under the use case view, our diagram name is HMS. Maximize this one to make the diagram. These are the tools associated with the use case diagram. This is for the selection, this is for the text. If you want to write some text, this is annotation. We are calling it doggy ear uh, box. Okay, it's only for the notation. This is for if you want to anchor any note item. This is for the package we are not adding the package this time this is use case, this is actor, this is the unidirectional association this is dependency and this one is generalization or inheritance so now we will start to this diagram first we will add the actor receptionist Second, we are having the admin or record system. We are giving the name it admin and the third actor is doctor. Okay. Now uh, we are going to make the use cases. We are having the first use case schedule patient appointment. select the use case schedule patient appointment you can increase the diagram second use case diagram we are having the patient admission scheduled patient hospital admission The third use case is patient registration. The next use case is patient hospital admission. file insurance forms or claims and 
file medical reports. Other use cases we are having add doctor, delete doctor, and edit doctor info. cases edit doctor by staff information for the doctor we are having the use case prescribed test We can add the use case as per our requirement, but for this diagram, we are having only prescription associated with the doctor. Now we will go for the asso uh, association. Unidirectional association receptionist. She is performing the patient appointment. Schedule patient hospital admission, schedule patient registration, schedule patient hospital admission, file insurance. He or she can file the medical report as well. Admin is associated with the to add doctor staff, delete doctor or staff, edit the info of doctor or staff. The doctor is associated with the prescribed test okay uh, this is the uh, external system now we are going to check the dependency for this one we are having one more use case bed allotment okay the bed allotment is having dependency on the patient hospital admission if you will see we are having here include include meaning is that the base class is having no existent uh, from the derived class okay that is uh, this included class is totally depend upon this one and the include shows that this is compulsory so add one more use case that is bit allotment okay. next because this is dependency we are having the dependency the bed allotment is totally depend upon the patient hospital admission and what is the stereotype right click on this dependency arrow open a specification go to the stereotype include Okay, select include, apply and OK. So this bed allotment use case is totally depend upon the patient hospital admission. If the patient will got the, get the admission, then only the bed allotment is possible. Okay. So it is having no, the existence of bed allotment is not possible without the patient hospital admission now other dependency if you will see we are having extended class that is schedule patient appointment uh, extend dependency actually it's optional
and for this one we are having patient registration is depend upon the patient appointment okay its meaning is that patient registration is only possible if first patient will go for the appointment then only patient registration is possible but this is extended class that is optional it's not necessary so this dependency from the patient registration okay this is in again right click on this one go to specification or stereotype label okay go to the stereotype select here extend apply okay okay so patient registration is depend upon the scheduled patient appointment next the next dependency is to the schedule patient hospital admission go to the stereotype again select extend now there is one more dependency is remaining that is patient hospital admission depends upon the patient registration this is compulsory because patient hospital admission without patient registration is not possible so this is include stereotype so we need to add the include dependency this we are selecting the dependency to display the dependency patient hospital admission is depend upon the patient registration stereotype include apply okay okay this is our use case diagram for the hospital management system it's ready now we can check for the validation go to the report show access violation okay if you will see here is no access violation is found so we can say that our diagram is validated if you want to write the system that this is hospital management system right here we have selected the text right here hospital management system this is the system the user we are actors we are having receptionist admin and doctor in this we have used the extent class and ex include dependency okay include dependency is compulsory that is we are having the compulsion for the bed allotment patient should register first patient should get the hospital admission for the patient hospital admission is possible only if there is a registration for the patient then only it's possible extend class is optional okay sometimes we are calling extend class uh, that it's having some derived value or it is generating some value depending upon this the requirement okay thank you for watching the video please subscribe the more videos